I'd like to take you on a tour of one of our disaster relief units that we have here in Harrisburg, Illinois. If you look throughout our unit, we have uh, lockers on everything label. We have all these tools that are available. So our tool manager is in control of everything. When a volunteer comes, we have all this available. If you look up here, we have everything is labeled. So we know where it is. It says come along, pallet puller, jump start box. Just constantly, everything's available for us. We have a workbench that our tool manager uses. If we have a broken chainsaw, if it needs to be sharpened or cleaned, he has the equipment to do what needs to be done so we can meet the needs of the volunteers. So when they go out, they have all the tools that they need. If you look over here, we have work lights, the tripod, roofing gun, uh, nailers, pass load cells, air hose, compressors. We have circular saws, grinders, everything that we need for a disaster. And here you'll see this, this one is open. So you can see we have the pitchfork. We have axes. If we're going to cut trees, if we're going to tarp roofs, we do mud outs on houses. So we have all the tools. And one of the things that we do, we work as a team. So to show who we are, every volunteer, when they come to work with us, will have a shirt real similar to this. So all of them will have Samaritan's Purse Disaster Relief. And we work together, and we, everybody knows that we are a team and that we show the love of Christ when out there. We also have drawers that have all the small hand tools, tin snips, scissors, claws, pry bars, hammers, all that is available. Also, the most important part of our project is when we go out, we work on a house. At the end of working on that house, we present this Billy Graham Training Center Bible to the homeowner. The whole team will sign that Bible, put scripture in there, and just tell them how much they love them as they pray for them.